Hey guys, it's Rose with Rose Likes Crochet. How is everybody doing? It is Saturday, August 7th, 2021, and I am coming on here with another Wings Update video. Oh my gosh, you guys are awesome. Sending so much stuff. This is so exciting. Okay, so today I have... Uh, 18 donations. Someone sent in three bags at the same time. <laughs> and I just wanted to get going on these to show you. For those of you who are new here, my name is Rose. I like to crochet. I like yarn a lot, like a lot. And uh, I took up making stitch markers. So please go check out my Etsy shop. I think I have like 120 listings for stitch markers and I am working really hard to try and get another um, update out there in the next week or so. So keep an eye out for that. Um, come follow me on Instagram. It's Rose Likes Crochet and come join our Facebook group. You only have to answer three questions to get in. They're really easy and we have a really good time. People talk about sales that are coming up. They show projects. They ask for advice. Um, there's just a lot of stuff going on in there. It's really, really fun. So um, yeah, that's it. So I do live in the Chicago area. I have one daughter. Her nickname is Carrots and we have a bunch of animals. So we call this place the zoo. So I do have a lot of donations I want to get through. Uh, I'm not going to show the packaging, although you can see there's some packaging here, but hopefully that'll save on a little bit of time and it won't make this video so long. So this month we are asking for donations for uh, winter wear. So hats, scarves, gloves, fingerless mitts, um, cowls, uh, anything that you think can be worn in the winter time uh, to keep warm since it does get pretty cold here in Chicago. Uh, September they are asking for aprons and doll clothes and if you want to see the complete list of what they're asking for please go check out um, everything in the description box down below. Okay are you guys ready because we got a lot to go through. <laughs> okay so the first package comes from one of our very own her name is Jax and she has a channel here on YouTube there is the really cool card she sent and <laughs> it just says balls <laughs> oh my gosh you guys really need to go check her out she is like a total ambassador for hat not hate this year and she is doing a phenomenal job so hi Jax. all right so her card says hi rose last minute i decided to try a stress ball i giggled a little but here they are <laughs> very much looking forward to the shawl brigade love Jax. okay so uh i'm not sure I haven't mentioned it to anyone yet about the shawl brigade, but um, there is something that is going to be starting up here pretty soon. Um, I'm just going to give you guys a little hint. There's two teams and uh, the proceeds of what's happening are going to go to wings. Uh, so what is being made? She said the shawl brigade, uh, the proceeds from that, um, it'll be sold on my Etsy shop and the pro hundred percent of the proceeds of that will go to wings, but there's more coming on that. You guys just need to look at my regular videos, not a wings video for that. Thanks Jax for participating. Okay. Here's one of her little stress balls. It's cute. I like it. What's wrong with it? And then this one, she writes, fresh lavender blossoms are inside. Oh my gosh. Uh, smell me and squeeze me. <laughs> okay. So, oh, oh, okay. Yes, that's good. Oh, I like that. That's a brilliant idea, Jax. Thank you so much for sending the two stress balls. I think they're pretty amazing. And I think you're pretty amazing. So you guys go check out Creations by Jax. So thank you for sending the stress balls, Jax. I appreciate it. Okay, next. So the next bag comes from Doris Wright. And she's still, I don't know if she's going by Rose Cottage Studio. She did write it on her label. Um, she has a YouTube channel, but she doesn't have any videos as far as I know. But you guys will recognize her. She's been sending um, packages to like Creative Grandma and me and like a whole bunch of other YouTubers. She's amazing. Hi, Doris. So there was no note in the box or in the bag but I have two um two sets here so I have a hat and a scarf set oh my gosh and it's just beautiful it's like thick and oh my gosh I love it um so it looks like it's this is part crochet and then knit and this looks like it's loom knit oh my god they're just beautiful Doris and then here is another set so I will just leave it folded and show you gorgeous so this one looks like it's knitted and then crocheted, no, knitted around the edge too, and the hat is crocheted. 
So Doris, thank you so, so much for sending these beautiful sets. I love them. I just think they're gorgeous and, and they're thick and that's exactly what we need here in Chicago. So I do appreciate it. Okay, next. So the next band comes from Anonymous Amy and she's from Kentucky. So she's not really anonymous. <laughs> she sent this card. It says, thanks. And she writes, uh, thanks for all you do, Rose. Hello, friend. I finally finished the special project I was making for you. I hope you like it. It's the pattern I used for the diaper bags for wings. It makes a fantastic project bag. I have more in my Etsy shop if anyone is interested. Also, here are a few stress balls for wings. Take care and keep crocheting Anonymous Amy. And her Etsy shop is called Anonymous Amy Makes and I will link it down below if I can figure out how to do that. <laughs> so let me show you the stress balls. So those are awesome. So it looks like there's eight stress balls in there and those are perfect. Thank you so much, Amy. And then here is the project bag she made for me. Oh my gosh, are you serious? Shut the front door, Amy. <gasps> it's so pretty. Oh my gosh. Okay, look at this, you guys. It's beautiful. So it's got a pocket on the front. Oh my gosh. Oh, there's pockets on the back too. Oh my gosh, this is awesome. It comes with this little satchet, satchel. Oh, it smells good too. I need to put that in the bag. And then it's a zipper. Oh my gosh, this is just amazing. And there is the inside of the bag. Oh my gosh, that is awesome. And it says stitch with love. This is perfect. This might have to be my new car bag. Oh my gosh, I love it. Amy, thank you so much. The fabric is beautiful and your workmanship is amazing and I just love it. Okay, so you guys go check out Amy. I'll list her Etsy shop down below. And thank you so much. This is really cool too. I'm gonna put it in the bag. Thank you so much for making the stress balls for wings. That's the best part of this package. <laughs> okay, next. So the next bag comes from Cheryl and she is from Michigan. And she sent me two separate bags inside her package. They were all in Ziplocs. So the first one says hat and cowl knitted with Premier Sweet Roll using a Premier pattern. Okay, so here is the hat. Oh, that is so cool. Oh, wow. I love that. And then here is the cowl that matches it. Oh my God, that is amazing. Holy smackerels, that's beautiful. Okay, my gosh, that's really, really pretty. And then she sent another bag and it says baby hats, knitted ribbed hats are super stretchy and fit larger head than expected. So here's two, oh my God, they're so cute and four. Oh my gosh, Cheryl, thank you so much for sending these adorable hats and the set. It's absolutely gorgeous. And I'm really excited to go bring this over to Wing. So I'm going to put them back in the Ziplocs because you have all the instructions written on there and we'll, we'll give it to them like that so that they know what's in there. So thank you again, Cheryl. I appreciate it. Okay, next. So the next bag comes from Joanne Russo and she is my neighbor here in Illinois suburbs. Hi, Joanne. And she sent a bag of stress balls and it looks like there is a note in here and it says on the top, I have no idea what I'm doing. <laughs> I have no idea what I'm doing. Oh my gosh, Joanne. She says, hi Rose, I am sending you some stress balls for wings. Sorry, they are late. I went to the post office last minute. That's okay. So here are the stress balls. They are awesome. I absolutely love the colors and they're great sizes and the workmanship is awesome. So you did a fantastic job. Thank you so much for sending them. And there's no need to apologize. I really, really appreciate it. Okay, next. So the next package actually didn't have a name on it or a return address. So whoever you are and you'll know who you are, I appreciate you sending me these. She sent, or he sent me a hat that looks like that. There is another one and another one. They're gorgeous. Oh, and another one. So there's four hats in there. And then she sent a zippered pouch or he, I am so sorry. I don't know why I assume everyone is a female that's donating because that's not the case. So there is a zippered pouch and that is awesome. And look at the inside. Oh, that's excellent. Thank you so much. Whoever this was that sent all these awesome hats and zipper pouch, I really, really appreciate it. 
Um, and it's okay if you want to remain anonymous. Anyone who sends anything, you are more than welcome to remain anonymous. Okay, next. So the next box comes from Connie and she's from Mississippi. Hi, Connie. She did send me a letter and she writes, Hello, Rose. I rose to the challenge of making stress balls for you. Only wish I had seen this sooner as I had so much fun making these balls. They became very addictive to me. I have a great passion for crocheting and giving. The enthusiasm you show makes it even more exciting to send things to you. You guys are so talented. It's very exciting. I tried to make them with yarn but decided to use Plarn, which is plastic yarn because that way I am helping to save our oceans through recycling and my stress balls can be cleaned with a disinfectant wipe. You are doing a great thing by helping people in need with these donations and I plan to continue to follow you. Woo woo! <laughs> Keep smiling and sharing Connie Jefferson. P.S. No plastic goes wasted. Walmart bread bags, toilet paper wrappers, paper towel wrapper, any plastic as long as I can cut it. So that is pretty stinking cool. So I have made Plarn a lot um, and I actually wanted to do a tutorial on Plarn on my channel and you know, things just happened and I just never got around to it. So maybe one day. <laughs> so, all right, I'm going to show you her balls and yeah, they're like not soft, but that's okay. You don't need a stress ball to be soft. It's made of plastic bags and it's awesome oh my gosh so here's two and then let's see here is five more they are so cool oh my gosh here is four more and then here's another one that's round and then there's heart shaped ones <gasps> no way are you serious that is so cool Okay, so I'm not really good at amigurumi. I'm not even gonna ask how you did that. <laughs> Look, she even sent a worry worm. Oh my gosh, that is so cute. So thank you so, so much for sending all of those stress balls and the worry worm and letting us know how you help to save the environment by sending these. And you're helping to helping people at Wings too. So that's pretty amazing. So thank you so much, Connie. All right, next. So the next box comes from Diane and she is from Wisconsin. Johnson, that's my neighbor to the north and she sent a box with some stress balls and there are three. Oh my gosh and then there's the lemon ones oh my gosh they're so cool thank you so much for sending these these are so awesome like I said I am not I'm not about the little things guys so I'm sorry all I donated was one stress ball and that's just gonna have to be okay <laughs> so thank you so much Diane for sending all of those stress balls they rock okay we got a lot more to go guys so the next box comes from Debbie Casto and she is from Nevada and she did send me a note along with some ball bands so that we would know what the yarn was she says both of these were made out of red heart the white and gray yarn spirations pebbled texture hat so there's the pebble texture hat and one warm coat crochet scarf so here is the scarf that goes with it so pretty and then she said the red and the gray was made on an addy so a hat basic 120 rows king a scarf basic was 240 rows small so here is the hat and then here is the scarf that goes with it so we got two sets so Debbie, thank you so much for sending the two sets and taking the time to make those and also to let us know what your directions were on there. I really, really appreciate it. Okay, next. So the next box comes from Linda Steinbrecher and she is from Florida. Hi, Linda. And she sent me a box of little, little baby hats, little toddler hats, and a couple she put in plastic bags and she labeled them. So this one I'm gonna show you, it says toddler on there. So there is the hat. And then you guys, look at how precious these little mittens are. O-M-G. Like that's killing me right now because that is just so cute. Okay, this next one says six to 12 months and wait till you see these little mittens. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh my gosh, for those of you with little babies. Oh my gosh, just smooch them, okay? Because I don't remember when mine was that little. <laughs> okay, the next one says three to six months gosh okay so here is one set it's got the little mittens and the hat <laughs> oh my gosh here's the next set look at these little tiny itty bitty mittens oh my gosh linda you are amazing and here is another little set <laughs> 
<laughs> okay, and then these were not in a bag, but these are also sets. So there's that one. Oh my gosh, these are just precious. There's that one. Here is a green one with the little mittens. Oh, shut the front door, seriously. And then here is another one with a pair of mittens. Oh, that is so awesome. Linda, thank you so much for sending in these adorable sets. I mean, like, could it get any cuter than little tiny mittens like that? I don't think so. So thank you so much, Linda. Okay, next. So the next box comes from Jessica and she is from Missouri. And I didn't see a note in the box and that's fine. So what I'm gonna show you is just, she sent a ton of hats. So I'm gonna show you all the hats that she sent. Oh my gosh, these are amazing. There's like a dozen hats or more in here. So here's, oh my gosh, they're so pretty. Check this one out. It's got like the little, you know what I'm talking about. It's a knight, it's the knight hat. <laughs> these are so cool. Jessica, how did you find time to make all these beautiful hats? Look at the pattern on that one. Okay, so I gotta show you guys that one. That's so pretty. Oh my gosh, here's another one like that. Jessica, what are the patterns? Can you tell us what the patterns are? <laughs> okay, and this one looks like it's a set. So there is a hat and a scarf for that one. So I'll make sure I keep those together. And that was it, but it was a big box. So I was, oh my gosh, so exciting. Oh my gosh. So Jessica, thank you so much for sending the big box of hats. Um, and if you have a pattern for this, let us know, cause I would like to try it. So thank you so much. They'll be really excited to get these at Wings. All right, next. So the next box was even bigger and that comes from Carol Williams and she is from Ohio. Hi, Carol, she did send me a note. She writes, Rose, just a quick note. As you can tell, I have a few favorite hat patterns like you do. The braided hats are bag -o day puff hats are bee hooked crochet and knitting. All the hats that look knitted by my granddaughter, Rebecca made. Hi, Rebecca. And my friend, ja Jen, Jan? Jan, my friend Jan donated all the soft yarn for scarves. Love all your videos, Carol. Oh my gosh, you had like a whole team with you helping you out with these. So there is so much to show you guys. Okay, and the box is right here. So I'm just gonna put them in the box when I'm done. Okay, so there's, I'll show you the loom knitted hats first. There's two, and then here are two more. My gosh, those are so cool. Um, there's two more love those and then I don't know if the rest if there's oh there is more loom knitted hold on a second <laughs> there's a lot in this box two more loom knitted and it looks like here's a couple more these are so pretty oh my gosh okay here's another loom knitted one and then these I think there's the puff one. Oh my gosh I love that there's another puff and a regular one. Oh, there's lots of puffy ones. I love that stitch. Okay, puff, puff. <laughs> Hold on, I think that belongs to a set. Here's another puff one. Oh my gosh, you guys are so talented. Thank you so much for sending in all of these hats. Here is a cowl. That's so pretty. Here is another one. Oh my gosh. Oh, there's another loom knitted hat. <laughs> And then I think here is a scarf. Oh, it's a granny scarf. Check that out. It's just the squares all put together. Love it. And then here is another cowl. Oh my gosh, I love these. Here is another infinity cowl. That's really pretty. Nice fall colors. Here is another one. Gosh, I love those colors. And it looks like here is a set because there is a cowl and a hat that match. Those are amazing. So thank you so, so much. Carol, you did an amazing job. I'm just trying to make sure nothing falls on the floor here. <laughs> you did an amazing job with all of those hats. Thank you to you and your team for and, you know, everyone who con contributed yarn and their time on the, the knitting machine and you actually taking the time to box these up and send them over here for wings. I really do appreciate that. Okay, next. So the next box comes from Martha and she is from Missouri and she sent me one of the famous llama cards. <laughs> I love it. And she writes, hi Rose, here are some winter items for wings. The pom-poms are attached with a simple bow for easy removal if the hats need to be washed. Thanks for the opportunity to reduce my stash. 
just a little from Martha. Please do not enter my name for any of the giveaways. Okay, so that's another thing. So we have thank you gifts at the end of every month. And if you do not want to be entered for them, you are more than welcome to tell me and I will make sure you don't get picked. Okay, <laughs> all right. So we're going to start. She put these in the box so nicely. I hate to unravel them, but she rolled up all her scarves so nicely. But here, I'm going to show you them. There's one scarf there. And then here is another one. This is like a velvet. Oh, yeah, that's nice. <laughs> and then here is another one that she rolled up. So I'll just show you guys that way. That's so pretty. Oh my gosh, I love it. Here's a real thick one. Oh, I love that one too. And it's not just because it's purple. <laughs> All right, and then we have a couple more. Um, oh, what is this? Hold on a second. Oh, this is a shawl, but you can wear this as a scarf. This is that Just Feel Festive shawl, but you can just fold it in half and wear it as a scarf. That's gorgeous. Wow, I never thought about that. Definitely need to try that. You know, you just make it a little bit skinnier, right? Oh gosh, that's so pretty. Thank you for that. Here is another scarf. Oh, that's so pretty. Everything is pretty, you guys. Everything. Do not ever, don't ever doubt yourself and think that you guys don't make beautiful stuff because everything you make is so pretty. There's one cowl. There is another cowl. And then there's headbands. These are like the velvet. Oh, these are so pretty. Not headbands. I keep saying headbands. They're ear warmers. They're so gorgeous. There's that one. Okay, so that's it for the cowls. Now here's some hats. Look at the cool pom-pom. I love it. Oh my gosh. Perfect. These are gorgeous. There's another one or another two. <laughs> there's, look at that pom-pom. I love it. And then there's another hat. So thank you so, so much for the hats, the cowls, the ear warmers, the scarves. Oh my gosh, that is incredible. I can't believe you got that all in that box too. <laughs> So thank you so, so much for sending all of those gorgeous donations. I really appreciate it. Okay, we got like six more boxes, guys. So the next box comes from Betty Lou Mallet, and she is from Massachusetts. And I don't think I saw um, a card, which is fine. Um, but I think she did send quite a few sets. So I'm going to show you there is a hat and a scarf set. Oh my gosh. And she put them in individual bags. So I'll make sure that I put them back in their bags when I'm done. Here is a hat and a cowl. Oh my gosh, they're so pretty. Betty, can you tell us what yarn you used for this? Because it is so pretty. I would love to know. Okay, and then we've got, uh, I thought we had a hat for that. Okay, we have this one, which is a cowl and a hat. Oh my gosh, that's so pretty. Okay, and then we have just a cowl. Gorgeous. And then we have, yes, here is another hat and a, and a scarf set. So let me show you guys this one. There you go. Put that over there. And then we have another cowl. Ooh, it's sparkly. <laughs> we have one of those twisted ear warmers and it's pink and sparkly. And then here is a, another cowl. And then we have a camo hat. That's awesome. Betty Lou, thank you so, so much for sending in all of these beautiful items. I really appreciate it. I'm really excited to, to deliver these. They're just gonna have tables and tables full for everyone to choose from. So I'm pretty darn excited for this. Thank you so much. Okay, next. So the next box comes from Rosalie Wright and she is from Pennsylvania. And before anyone says anything, it's not the one that has a YouTube channel. <laughs> she had to correct me before. So thank you, Rosalie, for sending these awesome sets. So I'm gonna show you guys. Uh, I think most of them are sets. There is a hat and a scarf. And then we have um, a hat and another scarf. Oh, my favorite color. <laughs> and we have a hat with some fingerless gloves. So I'll stick that inside the hat there. And then we have this beautiful cowl and hat. That's awesome. Oh, my goodness. All right. And then it looks like we have mittens, a hat, and a cowl. So there is a three-piece set. There we go. Oh my gosh, and they're so pretty. Holy smack rolls. Wow, this is insane. Rosalie, you are just super talented. 
here is another hat and a scarf. Here is a divine hat. Here is just a regular scarf with the long fringes. That's beautiful. There is another scarf. Oh, I love those baby colors. Here is, looks like another scarf. Gorgeous, absolutely gorgeous. Wow, Rosalie, that's a lot of work. Thank you so much for um, choosing to you have wings as your charity and to donate all of these items. I really do appreciate it. And um, let's get to the next box. So the next box comes from Sean Fuller and she is from Michigan. And I didn't see a note and that's fine, but I did see three stress balls. Woohoo! Oh my gosh, love them. Then there's a ton of like hats and scarves. So let me show you. I don't know, I think some of these are sets. So I see a black hat. And then I see this beautiful set. It is a hat and a cowl set. Oh my gosh, Sean, what yarn is this? Because it is luscious. Oh, I love it. <laughs> okay, and then we have another hat and a scarf set. Look at those baubles. Oh my gosh, that's so cool. And what pattern is that? <laughs> like, we're going to ask you all these questions. Here is another set. Again, this yarn is so soft. Sean, what yarn is this? Because it's beautiful. And then we have a uh, ear warmer and a, an infinity scarf. That set is nice. Here is just a cowl. Here is another cowl. Oh my gosh, that's beautiful. And then we have, oh, it's like one of those infinity cowls. You can't tell if it's going or coming or going. <laughs> it's beautiful though. Here is uh, some ear warmers. There's those. This is a absolutely gorgeous scarf. Oh my gosh. Look at the colors on that. And then we have a little teddy bear hat. Oh, <laughs> there's another hat. Oh my gosh. Look at these hats, you guys. And look at how precious that one is. Wow, Sean, you did so much work. Thank you so much for sending these to Wings. Um, I appreciate it. They appreciate it. And you should feel really good about yourself. Okay, we have three bags from the same person and then one more box, guys. So the next box comes from Nancy and she is from New Jersey. And she sent this beautiful card. And she writes, Rose, please accept this donation for wings, 20 bulky hats, and one hat and cowl set. I am in awe of all your work. These hats are a donation from a project that I've been doing since my mother-in-law passed away years ago. I have been crocheting for charity as well as commission only to put money made back into buying socks for the homeless. So I thank you for getting these hats to these beautiful ladies. Please make sure Wings tells these women all these handmade items are made with love for them as they may be feeling as if no one does. We love you ladies and men who are in this situation. So remain safe, get strong, and know that you are worth it from Nancy. Those are beautiful words, Nancy. Okay, so let me show you the hats. They are so pretty. There's two. Oh my gosh, these are beautiful. I'm gonna try and show you all the ones that look the same. Gosh, those are so pretty. Four, oh, is this that balloon yarn? Six, it's so gorgeous. Oh my gosh. Eight, those are just so pretty. Here is 10, and they are chunky, nice warm hats. Oh my gosh. 12, 14, 16. Oh, these are so pretty. 18. Oh my gosh, look at that one. 20. And then here is the hat and cowl set. And it's just as beautiful. Thank you so much, Nancy, for your kind words for the people at Wings. And if everyone else can just keep these people in their thoughts, that would be awesome. Positive vibes, guys. Positive vibes. Okay, one more person with the donation. So the next three bags came from Betsy Allen, and she's from Massachusetts. Hi, Betsy. Okay, so she had the bags labeled um, bag one of two for wings, two of two for wings, and the third one was labeled Happy Mail. So I'm just going to show you the Happy Mail real fast, and she put a card in there, and then that way we can get to the donations. So she sent me three balls of this beautiful red heart roll with it. Oh my gosh, it's gorgeous. And then she sent me this postcard. 
Oh, Betsy, you're so sweet. And she says, hi, Rose, carrots, and critters. Just a little something for you, Rose, for all you provide to all of us crocheters. I thought this yarn was beautiful and made me think of a summer's night sky. When it gets to being chilly, chocolate will be sent. <laughs> Hugs and kisses from Betsy. <laughs> yes, you guys, I'm a big chocolate freak, but it's like 90 something degrees here, like almost every other day. So don't send any chocolate until it gets cooler. <laughs> Thank you so much for the yarn, Betsy. You didn't have to do that. And I really do appreciate it. Okay, then she sent, and she I knew that this was coming. She sent a bag of baby clothes. So I'm gonna leave those in there so they can sort through those. Thank you so much for that. And then also just so you guys know, um, if you wanna go to smile.amazon.com, you can, if you shop at Amazon, you can add wings as your charity, but you have to do it through smile.amazon.com. And then a really small percentage of what you buy, doesn't come out of your wallet or anything, will go to wings. Um, so you can do that. You can also check and see what their wish list is for wings. And that way, if you don't want to send something here, but like say you have Amazon Prime, you can buy something off their wish list and it'll go directly to them. So just a couple other options for you. Okay, so let's see what Betsy sent. So there's a couple bags of hats and then a couple bags of sets. So I'm gonna show you the first bag of hats. Oh my gosh, Betsy, you're a machine. So there's two, four, oh, beautiful, six, I love these colors. Eight, 10. Oh my God, how'd you get them to be perfectly the same? <laughs> so there is 11 hats and that was in one Ziploc bag. Okay, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. Oh my gosh, you're truly a machine. 18, 19, and 20 so 20 hats all by themselves and then there's a bunch of these sets that are in like ziploc baggies so let's see what she's got here so she had five of these little sets and they i think they all say hat and scarf this one says machine wash warm dry on low and so this is the set oh it's so pretty it is a scarf and a hat oh my gosh and then this one also says machine wash warm, dry on low heat. So I'm gonna keep these, put them all back in the bag. So there's the hat and the scarf. Uh, the next one says machine wash warm, dry delicate. So this is this set right here. Oh my gosh, that is so pretty. <laughs> and then this one says machine wash warm, dry low heat. And this is a hat and a scarf. Gosh, these are so pretty. And the last one says machine wash warm, dry, low heat. And this is a hat and a scarf. Oh my gosh, I love them. Betsy, can you tell me what yarn this is? Because it's really, really pretty. I like it a lot. And then she's got another bag. Okay, in this bag, she's got one of these little scarves. Oh, that's so pretty. And then she's got some hats, more hats, because 20 hats wasn't enough. <laughs> she had to put more in there. <laughs> so there you go. So that is all from Betsy. Betsy, thank you so much for sending in all of these wonderful hats and scarves and sets and the yarn. You didn't have to do that, but I really do appreciate it. And that is it. Oh my gosh. I cannot wait to bring this over to Wings, you guys. So remember, leave a positive comment. Um, if you want to share, just let everyone know that we're doing this charity donation for Wings. I would appreciate it. And you guys take care. I'm pretty sure I'll have another update in a couple of days. So we'll see you soon. Okay, bye.